Making a splash at this year's Gasparilla International Film Festival was Hotel Mumbai, the kind of mostly true story about a 2008 terrorist attack on the Posh Taj Hotel in Mumbai, India. Oscar winner Dev Patel delivers a great performance as a hotel staffer turned hero. But did this movie get it right or should it have been better? First of all, let me say that from an action standpoint, Hotel Mumbai really delivers. It is absolutely unrelenting as director Anthony Morris hammers away at an already intense story with lots of unsteady handheld shots, graphic violence, and rapid fire editing, all designed to put you on the edge of your seat and keep you there. Unlike other terrorist action flicks like Die Hard, you're given very little opportunity to catch your breath for the entire two hour runtime and absolutely no comic relief. I think it's an effective way to tell the story as the real hostages who endured this attack were given no respite, and neither are we. And another important takeaway for me is that in the real world, there's not a Bruce Willis waiting to save the day. Hotel Mumbai is a brutally frank and honest look at terrorism. All that said, I think that at a certain point, it begins to break down and lose its initial impact. The audience becomes somewhat desensitized to the frenetic pace and over-the-top violence, and the film suffers as a result. A friend of mine who saw it with me said he felt manipulated, and I agree. The movie goes to great lengths to make you care about the characters and then kills them off in graphic fashion again and again. Used once or twice, it's an effective device. Beyond that, however, it does become overtly manipulative and kind of feels pointless. And because the pace is so frantic, there is absolutely no room for character development. Frankly, I think this is a much better film if at the point where the hotel staff herds the terrified guests into the relative safety of the club, it had shifted gears and become more of a character-driven movie. Imagine 12 angry men set against the backdrop of a terror attack instead of a murder trial, where the helpless hostages are thrust together into a room isolated from what's going on outside, and we can really see what happens to these characters under pressure. I'm just scared. We all are. But uh, to get through this, we must, we must stick together. Overall, I kind of liked Hotel Mumbai, but I think it could have been a much better film with a slightly different approach. The fact that it's based on actual events is sobering, and its story of humanity and heroism is powerful and ultimately triumphant. Be warned, however, this one's not for the squeamish or faint of heart. Check into Hotel Mumbai at your own risk. Don't open the door, it's them! Out! My kid is upstairs. Do you have a family? Yes. And I hope to stay alive and see them. No one's coming for us. We go down the back stairs and straight out the service exit. If they hurt us, we'll all die. We take our chances. Heather. Yeah,